Hi, I'm Travis Cook. And I'm Jared Hatfield. And this is Tablet Tips. Today we're going to be reviewing the HP Compact TC4400 tablet, my personal favorite. This tablet has a 12.1 inch screen and all the standard requirements of Speed School requires on a tablet. The, the requirements for the Speed School are going to be 2 gigabytes of RAM and a dual core processor. The Vista will run just fine on those specs. The good thing I like about this computer is it has an active digitizer as well. The active digitizers really make a difference when you're taking notes in class. The precision is excellent. Just to, just to recap, what an active digitizer is means that I can hover my computer over the screen. It is actively at all times trying to track the pen. I cannot use my finger and play with it. I have to use my pen. And also, this screen is really nice because it's not very wobbly. Unlike my tablet, the screen wobbles a little bit. The Toshibas have a problem with that. Very sturdy. In fact, the swivel, I don't think this thing will ever break. It's one of the most sturdy I've ever actually had. Very nice screens for taking notes on. Now, one of the cons about the size and about the screen is the size. It's very nice to ride on. I can put it in slate mode and carry it around, not look like I'm trying to carry a 200 pound tablet. It's really not that heavy. They're fairly light. You can walk around with them very easily. But I really don't want to put this in front of me and watch a movie. It's fine for tablet tips, but not so much for Titanic. The other feature that might hurt a few people is there is no CD ROM drive on this computer. None at all. No eject button. Personally, as the guy who uses this tablet every day, I don't miss it. But there are several occasions. Like, you want to install software for a CD for a friend, you might be out of luck. Yeah, you have to wait till you go home or, if, you know, put up a couple hundred pounds with the software and install an external CD ROM drive. You can just lug your external if you really need it. Yeah. Although there are other models that have the internal CD ROM drive built in with the same form factor, as I know personally. All right, uh, keep, just keep that in mind. Some people would love it, some people don't really care like me. Jared here loves to see your own drives. Moving on, however, one thing else I like about this tablet is the battery life. Very rarely do I have to worry about trying to find a plug-in. I like Jared, who chases it all day. Even battery life is very important when you're in class. You really don't want to go to that third class with zero battery life and there not be a plug. Still, I can always suggest getting the extended life battery. This tablet can reach up to 11 or 12 hours if you get the extended battery. Costs about $100, but I think it's a worthwhile investment. The extra batteries are definitely helpful if you don't want to be plug chasing all day and, oh my gosh, where's my plug? Yeah, it's kind I of I need my power supply. Another thing about this tablet that I like, but my girlfriend doesn't so much, is it's not pretty. This tablet is black and boxy. Very. And it has a little silver button, but that's about it. Very bland, but... It, it gets the job done. It's professional looking. It does what it needs to. I can take this to an interview, and it matches my suit. You know, it's black. I like it. Keep that in mind, though. Your girlfriend won't say, ooh, pretty. On the plus side, she'll never use it. She'll be begging for tablet. True. Anyway, let's get back to the tablet. Some computers will come to you straight from the manufacturer full of all kinds of bloatware, as we call it. You know, the Nero super awesome CD-ROM times 10 that you don't preview. really want. <laughs> yeah, preview. Works for five days. 10 day done. This tablet was surprisingly very light on it. There were a few of the standard DVD reading applications, which, come to think of it, why do I have a DVD watching application? That's a good question. I don't know, but this came with it. It was surprisingly light. I would not have reformatted this when I got it like I would with most computers. To sum up, I really like this computer. Obviously, I own it, and I must highly recommend it to anyone. Just keep in mind... You're missing out on the CD-ROM drive, which can kind of hurt, but if you get one with the CD-ROM drive, you're paying a lot more, so it is a premium feature still. Plus, the weight is a direct proportion to no CD-ROM drive. The screen size can scare a few people. They'll be like, I want my nice wide screen. When you're taking notes on it... It's the size of a piece of paper. Yeah. Just remember that. Perfect it's, size. It's a good, good size. But thank you for watching Tablet Tips. We'll be back soon with more reviews and more tips just for you. Stay tuned.